So now I'm gonna be showing you guys how to bedline wheels. We bedline in this Range Rovers. They're Foose wheels. Got a bunch of curb rash. They were uh they were powder coated before. But I'm just gonna show you guys how to clean them all up and paint them. I just got done bedlining this F-150. I'll put some before pictures now. And here's after. I also just got done painting this bull bar. This one's gonna go in my truck. Really well. So for this bull bar, I did a little bit deeper black. I think it's called the Ultra Black by Raptor Liner. It's a lot deeper than my truck out there. I look good with it. But I'm gonna also be doing the the Range Rover wheels in this Ultra Black, and then putting a gloss coat on top. So I've got the wheels all scuffed up and cleaned up. I just started taping them off last night, didn't get to all of them. I'm gonna have to peel more of this paint off before I start painting it. They all look pretty clean. I'm gonna cover the rotors, the brakes, all the lug nuts in the body of the car. Yeah. I just got them all masked off. I put a light coat of the black duplicolor uh, spray, like the peel coat, on the curb brush so it wouldn't show as much whenever I'm doing the bed liner. Should help out a little bit with making it stick better too. I don't know if you guys can really see it right now. I'll try to go right here where the light is. I'm gonna spray the bed liner on there. Just got the wheels done. Got the first coat done at least. So I put another layer of bed liner on there, and then I spread a clear uh, gloss coat on too. Might be able to see this one better. I'm gonna add one more layer of gloss coat and then we'll be done. I also took some pretty cool pictures after I got it all unwrapped and everything, so I'll play those now. That's gonna wrap it up for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Sorry I didn't film much of the bedlining process. But I feel like it gets kind of repetitive after a while, so thanks for watching.